Hey everyone. Welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates on finance and technology. Today, we have some incredible news to discuss about the upcoming banking reforms announced by ELEC. These changes could significantly impact how we manage and think about money. So, let's dive in. Lately, ELEC has been making waves on television, sharing a wealth of information about the new reforms. He's like a bird singing the news every day, and it's captivating to watch. We're already seeing significant growth in our digital system. By the end of this year, we'll implement the initial plan to complete these reforms. Isn't that thrilling? Alec has been emphasizing the incredible growth of our digital system. This growth isn't just a statistic it's a sign of the future we're heading into. The reforms are on track, and we can expect to see real changes soon. Now, let's break down what ALAC means by digital information. This is one of the cornerstones of the monetary reform, and it's going to play a pivotal role in shaping our financial land escape. Imagine a world where your money can float freely and not just within our borders, but internationally as well. This means that sending money to friends abroad or making purchases from international sellers will become simpler and more efficient. With these reforms, we'll be moving towards a digital currency system that is recognized globally. This isn't just a convenience it's a game changer for everyone involved. So, what does this international recognition mean for you? For starters, it opens up a world of accessibility to markets that were previously hard to reach. Think about it our cross-border transactions that are smoother and faster. With digital banking, you'll have the power to manage your finances from anywhere in the world. Whether you're traveling for business, studying abroad, or just buying something from an international website, this reform will make those processes much easier. And it's not just about convenience. Alec also highlighted that these reforms are crucial for strengthening our economy. As the digital system grows, it positions us better on the global stage. We'll have enhanced capabilities to compete and innovate. Absolutely, Alec. It's exciting to think about the potential for job creation and economic development. This is particularly important as we move towards a more digital world. The youth will especially benefit from this shift. With a focus on digital skills and financial literacy, they'll be better prepared for the job market and entrepreneurial opportunities that arise. But let's talk about the practical aspects of these reforms. How will they actually affect your daily life? For one, managing your personal finances could become much more streamlined. You might find yourself using mobile apps and digital wallets more than ever, which could lead to better budgeting and saving habits. Imagine being able to track your spending in real time, receive instant notifications, and even automate your savings are all from your smartphone. This level of control can empower you to make more informed financial decisions. And let's not forget the potential for increased security. Digital banking systems often have advanced security measures in place, which could help protect your money from fraud and theft. From biometric authentication to advanced encryption techniques, digital systems can offer a level of security that traditional banking might struggle to match. So, what's next? The implementation of these reforms is expected to begin by the end of this year. It's a pivotal moment for our banking system and it will be fascinating to see how these changes unfold. Community engagement will also be crucial during this transition. People will need to be informed and educated about how to take full advantage of these new systems. Now, I want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on these upcoming banking reforms? Are you excited about the potential of a digital banking system? How do you think it will impact your daily life and financial habits? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Let's start a conversation about the future of banking and what it means for us. Thank you for tuning in. If you found this video insightful and want to stay updated on the latest news about these reforms and more, 
Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We'll be covering all the developments as they happen.